Yo, what is up you guys? Welcome back to another video and for today's video guys We have absolutely just the most disgusting roblox news to ever report like I can't believe it's becoming so common nowadays on roblox like it's absolutely ridiculous another person who is famous on roblox just got exposed for being a child predator like Holy crap, dude, a freaking another one. So as you can see here from Ruben Sims tweet, one of the games in Roblox's upcoming classic event is managed in part by Child Predator, and he is the community manager for Toilet Tower Defense. He targeted a vulnerable 15 year old in the middle of a breakup to sexually groom her for several months over Discord. And as you can see here in the DMs pictures, like I am warning you guys right now, you guys may literally lose some brain cells after reading this DM because it's just so disgusting. Like this is really it's pathetic. So as you can see here, and he verifies that the victim he is talking to is 15 years old. And then he goes and verifies himself that he is actually 20 years old. So if you were to know 15, you know, and 20, you know, you should not be dating, okay? A 20 year old should not be dating a 15 year old like that is highly legal makes you literally a child predator and as you can see here here's a few more dms from in he and the victim uh, that they exchanged with each other and as you can see here it, it's getting really vulgar and disgusting like as you can read it, it's becoming super super weird and it gets even worse like you can see in he start talking about impregnating the freaking victim like he has some kind of impregnation kink like it's, it's so it's freaking like just oh just so disturbing and yeah so and he was fully aware of this victim being 15 years old at the time and he didn't care he still talked to this victim like 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 really sexually and really disgusting and talking about all these kinks and the things he wants to do to her and how he calls himself the d word like you can see he calls himself the d word to her which is just super just, just super disturbing in many levels and, and i i can't believe this is so common nowadays on roblox like you would think after 100 plus predators were exposed last year roblox would do you know better moderating their platform and hopefully targeting these predators and getting rid of them themselves but no these predators keep popping up it just it just keeps getting worse and worse and as you can see a ruben sim took his effort to notify roblox about this predator three days ago and they did nothing like when, when ruben sim i mean made a uh, formal like report to roblox about this person roblox did absolutely nothing like i want you guys to literally hear this and understand that roblox did absolutely nothing in regards to removing in which is just really weird like i don't know why roblox would do nothing like i thought roblox you know took child safety serious but i guess not but 90 minutes after he tweeted out onto his ruben sim twitter account about in his situation then they finally started to take action only when ruben sim tweeted out which is just wow i i can't believe you have to be ruben sim to get actual good moderation from roblox like roblox that just tells me that roblox really needs to work on their moderation but yeah uh, the situation after all just gets worse you would think oh the situation can't possibly get worse but it does we later find out that in he was contacting not just one minor he was contacting multiple minors uh, as you can see here he was actually contacting a different minor who was 16 years old at the time and he was sent evidence last night that he paid someone okay he paid a minor robux to have a virtual e you know what in a condo game like i just want you guys to put that in your brain okay someone paid some cash to have a virtual e you know what in roblox like dude that is such a degenerate thing to do like how much of a low life do you have to be to be doing something like this with your free time on roblox especially with kids like this person and he he needs to be you know he needs to face justice he needs to be sent to the proper authorities and hopefully land himself in prison because he's literally a child predator he's a very dangerous individual in the community and he needs to be in prison like literally he needs to be in prison uh let me know down below in the comments on your thoughts about this i know some of you guys for fans of in heat because you know he's a manager of a pretty big game the toilet tower defense game I'm, I'm sure some of you guys play that game so i'm sure 
A lot of you guys are heartbroken to find out about what in he was doing behind the scenes but it's just a hard reality man you can't trust anybody out there even if they're friendly even if they're like it doesn't matter like if you guys have any more information regarding in he that would be very valuable please send it over to ruben sims twitter account so if you do have more information give it to ruben sims so he can work on it and investigate further into in he and move all this stuff to the proper authorities but yeah guys that is gonna be it for today's video another predator exposed on roblox what a surprise i know what a surprise anyways uh that's gonna be it for today's video if you have enjoyed this video today make sure to slap that like button and that red button to support me and my channel but anyways you guys i'll catch you guys later peace out